Is it creepy or cool just how your smartphone is outsmarting you? We uncovered security concerns about your phone that may shock you. It took us a few clicks, but we found your iPhone is following you to home and work without you knowing, and it's also happening on your Android devices as well. This is the newest smartphone personal assistant, similar to Siri on the iPhone. My name is Siri, but you knew that already. It's called Google Now. It can search the web, but also scan through my Gmail, finding personal information, like this flight itinerary. Southwest Airlines Flight 498 from LA. But that's not all Google or Apple are tracking. What we found didn't just surprise me. Oh, wow. We surprised moms at the marketplace. Oh, my God. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. Kelly got a little nervous at this coffee shop. A little trippy. And these guys didn't realize their smartphones were so involved with their business. So your phone has tracked you at these locations. Most found this use of technology more creepy than cool. What no one knew about is this your location history. I wanted to try this out for myself, so I activated Google Plus on my iPhone. What I discovered was my phone was tracking my every move. With my GPS off, using Wi-Fi signals and cell phone towers, my phone told Google everywhere I was. Like this day when I ran with my phone around Jastrow Park in downtown Bakersfield, or this next time when I went to Dagny's to talk to these smartphone users. Kind of terrifying. My phone's been stolen before, so... Kelly Hatzenbiller is someone who values her privacy, yet, just like me, she had no idea her phone can track her with her GPS off. The fact that they can, like, track where you've been is a little frightening, I think. I think that's, like, a really big invasion of privacy. Google's privacy statement reveals how your privacy disappears. When you use a location-enabled Google service, we may collect and process information about your actual location. In short, when your GPS is off, your smartphone can still outsmart you. Based on the signal strength of your cell phone and the different towers that your cell phone is able to see where you are, down to a couple of feet. Security expert Steve Betty says there's now a trade-off between convenience and privacy. Knowing your location allows Google to make suggestions about what's nearby or pop-up coupons based on where you're at. This helps Google target ads. It's one thing having advertisers um, linked into where you're going and what you're doing, and totally different thing if the government's tracking you or something like that. And wait until you see what else Google is tracking. I've never told my phone where I live or work, but it guessed for me and even tracked the times I left and arrived at each location. And Google is keeping tabs on the places I visit the most. It also tracked me in downtown Bakersfield when I met Alyssa Lorizana. It's freaky. She was surprised to learn her phone knew when and where she spends most her time. What if someone steals my phone? Then someone can know where I live or where my boyfriend lives or where I go to school and what time I come home and stuff like that. You can delete your location history, but to turn off the setting, we found it's not so simple. In fact, five steps. One, go to your settings, click on privacy, then location services. Here, you'll see all the apps that know your location because of your GPS, Wi-Fi, and cell signal. Keep going into system services and find frequent locations. This is where you can turn off the covert tracking. I think it's going to bother someone who uh, is doing something that they shouldn't. Their main purpose was to spy on people. Brilliant. <laughs> Not so funny for those who feel their smartphone has outsmarted them. I know the phone is smarter than I am. And on the iPhone, we found frequent locations are tracked. If you downloaded the new iOS 7 update, and right now on the 23ABC app, we have tutorials. You can click through right there and scroll to the bottom on how you can take back control of your Android or iPhone. Jackie, back to you. All right.